Hi, guys! Oh, it seems like a little bug has sneaked in. Do you know what it is? Click play and have fun with Alex and Lily! Hi, Lily! <laughs> it seems like you have a new visitor! <laughs> we could dress you up as a cute little ladybird if you like! What do you guys think? You can tell us in the comments what other bugs you'd like Alex and Lily to dress up as! They have loads of different names depending on the country! Ladybird, Ladybug, Lady Beetle, Lady Cow! Let's see what we have in the wardrobe! These insects can come in different colours, but the most well-known ones are red and black! First, we put on the t-shirt! Perfect! Now we put on the black tights! As if they were insect legs! <laughs> And here is one of your favourite items of clothing! A red tutu! Do you like it? And to finish up, you'll need these shoes so that you can run around! A fun fact about them is that they live in the grass, in the bushes, in plants... And they have antennae like these! You're going to look amazing, Lily! You'll see! <laughs> Magic hairband! <laughs> Check out these cool wings you just grew! <laughs> now you're a flying insect! <laughs> and to top off your costume, let's make you up! <laughs> Firstly, we apply red blusher, red like your t shirt! <laughs> so cool! Check out all of the colors we have, Lily! We use this brush, dip it in makeup, and apply it here and over here. There! Hmm. I think we should also put on red lipstick. Okay, close your mouth now. It looks great on you, Lily! <laughs> oh, and we can't forget about your eye shadow. What I like the most about these costumes is that we can do really cool things with makeup! <laughs> it's going to look fantastic! And it also has loads of glitter in it! And lastly, we draw tiny dots on your face that match the ones on your costume! Oh, by the way, do you know how many dots ladybirds have? What about you guys? Have you ever counted them? They have seven dots! <laughs> Though it might seem like they have more sometimes! <laughs> there! All done! <laughs> Check it out, Alex! I have found a new species from the Coleopterus family! <laughs> yes! A new type of ladybird! It's a lilybird! <laughs> Hi, Lily! <laughs> it seems you have a new companion! <laughs> if you want, we can dress up as a beautiful butterfly! Yay! There are more than 24,000 different species! Ooh. And they live around the world! <laughs> Except in Antarctica, of course! It's really cold there! Hmm. Let's see what we have in the closet! The most striking of the butterflies are their colors. They can be white, yellow, orange, but in your case, you will be several at once. Look! First, let's put on the shirt. Perfect! And now the black stockings. As if they were the legs. <laughs> and here's your favorite cloth. A pink tutu with glitter. Do you like it? Yeah! Finally, and so you can settle on the flowers, we're going to put these tiny shoes. <laughs> A curiosity is that all butterflies have antennas where they concentrate their sense of touch. Like this, Lily, look! You'll see how pretty you're going to be, Lily. Wow! 
Wow! Look at the cool wings you've got! Now you are a beautiful and lovely flying butterfly! <laughs> to complete your costume, we'll put a little bit of makeup. First, we'll put a pink tone on your lips. Let's see. Close your mouth. You look good, Lily. Let's not forget the eyeshadow. Look how many colors, Lily. Wow. What I like most about these insect costumes are the colored eyeshadows. First one eye. And then the other. And it also has a lot of glitter. <laughs> Ready? We're done, Lily. Look, Alex! Here you have a butterfly fresh from its chrysalis. Yes, the butterflies do a metamorphosis. And they go from being a larva to becoming free flying butterflies. Like the beautiful lily butterfly. <laughs> Hi, Lily. Today we're going to play with the costume roulette. We have four different insects. The ladybug, the bee, the butterfly, and the dragonfly. You already dressed up as a ladybug, remember? Let's see which one you get today. I have a question for you. What other types of animals would you like our babies to dress up as? Write your ideas in the comments. Great! Let's learn more about bees. And let's put a nice yellow and black outfit on you. Let's put the surprise roulette away and see what's in the closet. Wow, so many things. First, let's put this striped shirt on you. There are different types of bees. Your costume is of the honeybee who has these colors. We're also going to put these socks on you. And you know what they feed on? Nectar and pollen from flowers. So guys, when you see bees near flowers or plants, don't bother them because they're looking for their food. It's time for the yellow skirt. How pretty. It's a tutu with sparkles. <laughs> You'll also need these shoes so you won't be barefoot. Lily, let's see if you can guess what you need to complete your costume. Very good! The antenna! They are very important because it's how they smell, hear, and touch. It's magic! Now you're a real bee with wings and all! <laughs> and we aren't done yet! Let's go to the beauty salon! Your clothes are similar to a bee's body. But your face isn't. So, let's do your makeup. First, we'll give the eye area some color. Look how many colors there are. <laughs> Close your eyes for a second, Lily. We'll paint them yellow, because that's the color that most represents bees. <laughs> and now, we'll make some details around them. We'll make some lines that finish in a spiral. Also, some stripes to match your shirt. And some dots to finish it all. You'll see how pretty you'll look, Lily. The makeup we're doing is perfect. Hmm, something's missing. What else can we do? Of course, your lips. That way, they'll stand out a bit more. Great. Here's a little bee ready to go to her hive. <laughs> Be careful, Lily. If you move like that, you'll surely fly. Sorry, Lily. Do you know what Alex has told me? That he has lost a tooth. And he's really excited because now he will be visited by the tooth fairy. <laughs> oh, I've just had an idea. Would you like to surprise him? What do you say we dress you up as the Tooth Fairy? I'm sure it will be a magical dress with lots of glitter! 
And what about you guys? Have you ever been visited by the Tooth Fairy? Please tell us in the comments. We'd love to know. Here we go, Lily. Today we'll start with your hair. We take out your hair ties and let your hair down. And now we dye it golden. The colour of magic. Done! Hey, you make a great blonde, Lily. You should wear your hair like this more often. <laughs> Fairies usually wear their long hair down. <laughs> Don't worry, Lily. We're not done yet. And we fasten your hair back with these cool hair clips. Perfect! We have your fairy hairstyle down. Now we just have to dress you. First, we should put on your dress. Check it out! It's so cool! It's even got a tutu! <laughs> and with that tutu, you should wear ballet pumps. <laughs> Look at you! You're ready for a ballet lesson! But you're not a ballerina, you're a fairy! So the most important thing is still missing. Your magic wand! Ta-da! But hang on a second. Something's wrong. Where are your wings? You won't be able to fly now. What is it, Lily? Oh, is that a new tab? It wasn't there before. <gasps> That's right! I forgot to crown your fairy! That was so absent-minded of me! <laughs> Yay! Now you're a true fairy! And you're ready to pay Alex a visit tonight! Oh, and remind him to brush his teeth after every meal! Mm. Otherwise you'll have to visit him quite often! <laughs> Hi Lily! <laughs> Lily, what are you looking at? What's in that jar? It's really sparkly! Oh, I think I know what it is! It's fairy dust! It looks just like Tinkerbells, remember? We can use it to do magic and see which costume you get! Hey guys, tell us in the comments what wish you'd make if you had magic fairy dust! Let's see, let's open it! Here is your new costume! <laughs> Do you know whose clothes these are? Let's find out then! First, we put on the corset. Now, we put on the skirt. I think you're a forest fairy! The colours of your dress are reminiscent of the colours in nature. And there's also a cool pair of tights and shoes. Do you know that this type of fairies loves music and can speak with animals? And they know loads about plants, rocks and spells. Now we have to do your hair and makeup. I love this crown. It's made out of leaves. Check it out, Lily! Your leaf crown is magic! <laughs> Fairies are very small, fantastic creatures with wings, just like yours! But you're still missing your makeup! Firstly, we put on eyeshadow. We pick colours that go well with your costume. Close your eyes for a sec, Lily. There. Perfect! You can open them now. <laughs> hmm. Now we have to add a touch of colour to your lips. This pink colour will be great. You'll see. <laughs> and lastly, we add a little decoration around your eyes. Since you're the protector of nature, it's best we give you a leaf design. It's going to look amazing! A bit more over here. And that's it! You look fantastic, Lily! I think this is one of the best costumes we've 